And of course it's night. Okay, whatever. Anyways, hello guys. Welcome to the Piglin. Wait, hang on. Welcome to the mc.piglin.org server. 1.19. All the way. So here's my lovely abode. Let's get out of here because you don't want to see that. You want to see cool builds and stuff, right? Yeah. Well, first we need to worship the shrine. Anyways, now that we have paid our duly respects to the Shrine of Pain, we must head off in our search for a good building spot. And just so that you guys know, if you do join the server, kind of, you know, help a guy out and join the kingdom. By the kingdom, I mean, Albagia. Some of you might be wondering, what the hell is this? Well, uh, this is uh, an SMP I've been playing on for quite a while, and so far it's been going pretty well. Um, I, how, how do I put this? I build up enough inf infrastructure where I can sell some stuff, you know, like, I built an iron farm and I've been selling iron. I've gotten a decent amount of money. Yeah, a decent amount of money, and I can pretty much buy anything I need to. However, I like building farms. So here is my iron- Hello, fancy boy. <gasps> I've got golden pants. I know you're jealous. Anyways, this is my iron farm. Uh, it produces something, something out of iron. I actually don't know. I just know that if I AFK right down here for about 16 hours, I get a double chest full of iron. So, you know, good, good stuff. A little bone meal in there from the poppies. And one thing I have found is that if uh, I forget that I'm a AFK and I come home and I just, er, Either I come home or I'm doing something else. I'll forget I'm, a I'm AFK and that's why I have a chest for the poppies here. It will never actually, you know, overfill. But the iron might. And I like to have a little backup here just in case. I have chests scattered everywhere that I really need to clean up. So, uh, you know what? I think I'm going to build myself a nice little storage room. Oh my god, what is wrong with my neck? I need to fix my skin. I will do that later on but anyways I'm gonna build a nice little storage room if you guys have seen my what was it 1.18 stuff you know 1.18 stuff you might have seen uh, my storage room was kind of built into a into a cave it's kind of luscious and look kind of cool well I don't necessarily want to do that again I mean I do but like I don't I really want to build a massive storage system. However, I don't have enough resources for that right now. I need to go mining for redstone and no one likes watching people mine. So I'll do all that off camera. Now down here is a nice big cave. And over here is uh, the pedestal of corruption. Yes, you heard me correctly. The pedestal of corruption. It's where we sacrifice those who have dishonored Albagia. Ouch. So I say we go ahead and get started on our storage system. Now thinking of how our storage system is going to be built, I have a general idea. And I'm thinking I'm going to go for almost like a cave aesthetic. Um, I know last time, you know, I, I just said I don't want to rebuild the last one I did. However, I am going to take some inspira inspiration Blackstone glass. I actually just thought about something. I could make the storage system right down here. I can make it kind of like an abandoned mine shaft. I think that would look really cool. And it would actually make sense because the lore of Albagia, essentially it was a group of miners who were out in the jungle trying to mine for gold, diamonds and stuff like that. And they came across this massive cave. Well, at the center of this cave was this weird bone structure with uh, some weird blocks in it. And they found out that going near the blocks doesn't really do anything. However, in several locations throughout the world, they've also discovered structures with these weird blocks around them. And they say that they summon uh, something called a warden. And apparently it likes to kill everything it hears. So I think having some, some sort of uh, you know archae archaeological dig site looking thing, where you have people trying to Look over this and figure out what it is, how to stop it, you know, normal stuff. And I think it'd be good to leave it dark like this. 
because the more mobs that come in the the more this will be active you know because i'll kill mobs and it'll spread and it'll spread more and more and more and once it breaches uh the bone we might be in for a little bit of a surprise so i'd say we go ahead and get started in a little bit of i don't know terraform oh my god i have an idea now but i will tell you if you're new to I think it's really good time. building for today i have run out of deep sleep so i will mine some more up and then we'll start another well not start you know continue this project next time but for right now i need to get restock my iron shop and yeah i built this nice little pathway going down going down you know as you probably saw in the time lapse i killed a bunch of mobs in there stuff stuff happened so now it is restock time for the iron shop so I'm just going to dump all this in here and dump all this in here. There. And that is the iron shop restocked. I'm going to head over here and grab my bits and bops box. So in order for me to complete my storage room, I'm actually going to need a decent amount of leather. Which means I need to build a cow farm. Or I can go buy all the leather, but I'd rather build a cow farm. And since we are in the, let's say, farming district of my base... I can put it right around this area and I'm actually thinking of putting it right here there's already a cow right there as well so yeah right here will work just fine there we go now a common theme around this area you might see is that my roofs are made of acacia planks don't ask me why that is that's just something I did a uh, while back on a different server and I liked how it looked bruh why is it lagging giving me my logs okay now i gotta find that cow wherever the hell it went hello cow follow me i feel like finding another cow might be uh, a bit challenging never mind get a sheep while i'm at it too i guess 
Go ahead and feed the baby cow like a crap ton of wheat. Should grow up pretty fast. Oh, that's cool. It grew up already. These guys can't be bred yet. Okay. And there's a small cow farm. So guys, that's going to be the end of this episode. I hope all of you enjoyed. And I hope to see you all in the next one. I'm Zaren. Peace.